hello and welcome back to my channel so today i've got another food shopping haul for you and i've been to sainsbury it's a slightly different kind of shop this week because it's actually my husband's birthday this weekend it's just all go throughout the month of august and september it's birthdays summer holidays back to school and my kind of routine goes a little bit out the window so it's my husband's birthday this weekend my two younger boys have just gone back to school and my older son goes to sixth form on monday so i've booked one night away this weekend to stay with steve in our van and this shop kind of reflects the fact that we're not going to be here all weekend we've also got a meal out planned and we'll probably have a takeaway at some point as well because it is his birthday and it's nice just to enjoy yourselves i've got lots and lots of bits for packed lunches and i have got some meals as well i'm also going to show you what we're going to be taking with us to eat when we go camping and my mum is staying with the boys so she'll be dealing with their food so a little bit of a different haul but still a haul nonetheless and i still spent about 80 pound which when i look at it i'm not quite sure how but sometimes my shops just go like that so what i would do is take through everything and i won't do a meal plan at the end like i usually do because i'll just explain as i go along it's easier so let's go and have a look at the video first off we've got some strawberries as you can see two pound 29 for 800 grams i'll probably eat most of these today we've got some of these anya potatoes and some raw garlic apples we've got some white seedless grapes some spring onions and some bistro salad and then meat wise I got some 5% fat beef mince, this is to make a spaghetti bolognese. Some chicken breast mini fillets which Steve and I are going to take away with us. We're going to take some tandoori chicken, we're going to do some little potatoes. Um, we also bought some halloumi to take with us. And we're going to have some wraps and some peri peri hummus as well. And that will be our dinner one night. And then we've got some sausages and some bacon so we can have a nice breakfast. And like I said, my mum's looking after the boys, so she'll be dealing with their food and things. Got some Gouda cheese slices, some of this British breaded ham, and some extra mature West Country farmhouse cheddar. So we needed packed lunch bits and things so we can make some nice cheese and ham wraps, that kind of stuff. I took Oscar with me and he asked for a cheese and bean pastry slice for his lunch. And I also got the older two boys a pucker pie. These were on offer for a pound. I think they're normally £1.50, something like that. Um, and they can have these for lunch with yoghurt and fruit or something. I got some cereal bars for back to school. So some apple and cinnamon Jordans. I got some yoghurt breaks and some Cocoa Pop bars. I got six free range eggs to take with us to have um, bacon and eggs in the van. And then I got some free range eggs just to have at home. Uh, Oscar and Jake both need a glue stick for school, so I've got just two of Sainsbury's glue sticks. I've got some pick and mix sweets, some rigatoni pasta to go with the uh, bolognese. I've got some of these noodles, I love Sainsbury's like world food aisle. These extreme hot and spicy noodles are only 40p and they're really really good and they say extreme because they are. And then I saw these which I've never tried before. They're actually labelled as tomato soup, like a tomato noodle soup, but when you feel them, they just feel like a packet of noodles. But I thought a tomato flavour ones could be quite interesting, and they were only 40p as well. I suppose if you add a little bit more liquid, they would be like a soup. Um, I got a deodorant for me, six cans of sugar-free strawberry and watermelon tango. I just thought that sounds really, really nice. I love watermelon flavoured stuff. I got two milks because they didn't have any of the four pints, so I got two two pints. A uh, bottle of jam shed, Shiraz to take away with us for Steve's birthday. If you like red wine and you like sort of really heavy, full-bodied reds, then I really recommend the jam shed. And it's quite often on offer. This was six pound, and it's usually seven. Some places it's eight. Run out of both Yorkshire teas, which I absolutely love: the toast and jam and the multi biscuit. So I got one each of those because they were on offer at £2. I think they're usually £2.30, but I really, really like them. And I wasn't sure I'd like toast and jam, but I absolutely love it. I got a tin of lent excuse me. I got a tin of lentil and bacon soup. I got a large tomato and herb bolognese. Uh, I got these to go with Steve's birthday present because he just loves Lindor chocolate. Some easy cook long grain rice i'm still making some burritos with leftover pulled pork that i bought and cooked last week and then i've also got a mixed bean chili so those two things are still on the meal plan so i needed some rice for those two squash one apple and one orange and mango and they're both no added sugar some rinse aid i've got some wild rhubarb 
antibacterial cleaner the by method this was two pound and it's one of my favorite ones I got some hot dogs because Oscar asked for hot dogs we haven't had them for a really long time so I thought I'd get them those as a treat for Friday night got some mission wraps they didn't have any of their own like branded ones in there some 50 50 vitamin boost which is interesting I've never noticed it say that before um, it was 69p instead of a pound it says it's got vitamin b1 and niacin vitamin d and calcium and iron and vitamin b6 so i don't know if that's extra to normal bread or whether all bread has that in but they've labeled it vitamin boost some jumbo hot dog rolls for the hot dogs i got some cheese top rolls i can't remember what for oh pat lunches um some oven bottom muffins these are so soft they're really really nice rolls i got some Walker's Squares, these were £1.25 for six, so I got two of those. One lot of hula hoop salted puffs and some fish and chips, six bags for a pound. So that is it for this week, guys. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe if you do enjoy this kind of content and leave me a like. It really, really does help my channel. I'm going to be back really soon with our first ever camping trip video and also our summer break to the Cotswold video, as well as lots and lots of recipes, cook with me's and meals of the week. So I will see you guys soon. Take care, everyone. Mm -hmm.